Chinese glazed roof tile. Glazed tiles Chinese, Liu Lai Wa have been used in China since the Zhou Dynasty c. 1046, 256 BC as a material for roofs. During the Song Dynasty, the manufacture of glazed tiles was standardized in Lai Jai's architecture standard. In the Ming Dynasty and Qing Dynasty, glazed tiles became ever more popular for top-tier buildings, including palace halls in the Forbidden City and ceremonial temples, for example the Heavenly Temple. There are two main types of Chinese glazed tiles, glazed tubular tile and glazed plate tile. Glazed tubular tiles are molded into tube shape on a wooden mold, then cut into halves along their length. A tube-shaped clay mold can be cut into four equal parts, with a cross-section of a quarter of a circle, then glazed into a four-plate tile. Glazed plate tiles are laid side by side across and overlapping each other. In the Song Dynasty, the standard overlap was 40%, which increased to 70% in the Qing Dynasty. With the Song-style 40% overlap, it was not possible to have triple tile overlap, as there was a 20% gap between the first plate tile and the third plate tile. Hence, if a crack developed in the second tile, water leakage was inevitable. On the other hand, with the Qing Dynasty style 70% overlapping, the first plate tile was overlapped 70%, 40%, and 10% by the second, third, and fourth tiles, respectively. Thus, even if the second and the third tiles developed cracks, there would be no leakage. Glazed tubular tiles used at the eave edge have an outer end made into a round-shaped top, often molded with the pattern of dragon. Eave edge plate tiles have their outer edges decorated with triangles to facilitate rain shedding. Equals equals references equals equals equals.